seal disassembly on a Gabionetti R-Type pump. We start with the decoupling of the driver from the pump by dismantling the coupling guard and consequently dismantling the coupling spacer. Then it's the turn of all the auxiliary piping that need to be dismantled, cleaned if necessary, and stored in a clean area up to their reassembly. We proceed with the dismantling of the pull-out pump R by the stuffing box bolts untightening. And if necessary, we use the provided jack bolts to pull it back for a couple of millimeters from the pump casing. We remove all the stuffing box bolts except at least one. That, for safety reason, should be removed only once the pull-out is secured by the mean of a lifting crane. Then we will be able to completely remove the pullout and send it to the maintenance workshop. Once the pullout is in the maintenance workshop, cleaned and decontaminated if necessary, it can be positioned on a stiff work table and secured with wooden beams and wedges, for example. We start with the impeller by dismantling its lock nut that is secured with an anti-rotation grub screw. Losing the grub screw, now we're able to lose the lock nut. Remember that this lock nut is left hand tightened, so it should be untightened counterclockwise. Then we pull the impeller and we remove its key. For the next steps, it will be convenient to position our pullout vertically and proceed with the dismantling of the protective cages to reach the mechanical seal. It's very important to secure the mechanical seal before proceeding by inserting the locking tabs in their grooves and by releasing the setting screws of the mechanical seal sleeve from the shaft. Now the mechanical seal is free and unlocked from the shaft. Now it's the turn of the bearing bracket separation from the stuffing box. We dismantle the bearing bracket bolts and we lift it up carefully by the mean of the crane.
it's very important in this step to not damage the shaft. Finally, we can dismantle the mechanical seal from the stuffing box. And it's a good practice to mark its position first by the mean of a marker. Thus, we dismantle the four bolts that hold the mechanical seal on the stuffing box and we will be able to lift it up and lay it on the work table in this correct position. Now we are able to replace the mechanical seal with a new one and revert back our steps up to the pump field assembly. In fact, the assembly in details is what reversally done during disassembly.